हेलो स्टूडेंट्स गुड टाइम टू ऑल आई एम चंदन कुमार प्रधान वेलकम टू दिट चैनल चंदन फिजिक्स इन दिस वीडियो वी आर गोइंग टू डिस्कस स्पेक्ट्रोस्कोपिक टर्म्स एंड नोटेशंस लेट्स एगेन बेसिकली वी नो लेट दैट इज द एटम व्हेन वी अप्लाई एन एक्सटर्नल मैग्नेटिक फील्ड due to its one electron system it has orbital angular momentum l and spin angular momentum s its resultant total angular momentum j it depreciates throughout that regions due to the torque it precises around it is the precision of spin then the precision of l and then the precision of its j the precision of j okay let it and uh, the quantized energy states of an atom electron are described in terms of quantum numbers the quantum numbers like n stands for principal quantum number principal quantum number l stands for orbital quantum number s stands for spin quantum number and j stands for total quantum number that the inner quantum number that is the inner quantum number this quantum numbers describe the energy levels of atomic electron so we have to follow some rules to define the notations rule number 1 the electron having orbital quantum number orbital quantum number l means 0 1 2 3 0 dot, 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 are named as named as like s p d f g orbital electrons orbital electrons when that l stands for 0 then the orbital electron stands for s in 1 that for p 2 for d these are the small letters and rule number 2 the atomic states in the atom the atomic states in the atom are specified by writing the corresponding principal quantum number 
writing the corresponding principal quantum number along with these letters. along with these letters let me prefer an example let me take an example what is that of example for n is equal to n is equal to 2 and l is equal to 0 for n is equal to 2 and l is equal to 0 it is written like this it is written as that is 2 l is equal to 0 it stands for s that is 2s 2s again for n is equal to 3 let n is equal to 3 n stands for principal quantum number and uh, l is equal to 1 how it can be written first n is equal to 3 it stands for 3 L is equal to 1, it stands for P. In the notation. Again, rule number 3. The energy levels the energy levels of electrons in an atom are called toms are called toms of that atom of the atom taking examples these are known as the terms. Taking example for L is equal to for L is equal to 0, 1, 2, dot dot dot. There are capital S, P, D, F, G terms respectively okay next another rule rule number 4 due to spin orbit interactions due to spin orbit interactions Each energy level of a given L is energy level of a given L and is orbital quantum number is split is split into two subcells, two sub levels. Example as J is equal to L plus S means half and J is equal to L minus half spin half spin minus half since S is equal to plus half only one value. since s is equal to plus minus half only one value ok then rule number fifth the number of different possible orientation the number of 
different possible orientations of L vector and S vector and hence the different possible values of the different possible values of j is known as multiplicity multiplicity known as multiplicity multiplicity of term and that terms equal to 2s plus 1 values and uh, the multiplicity the multiplicity of uh, one electron atom the multiplicity of uh, one electron atom is 2 how it is written it is added to the left superscript to the term symbol it is added to the left superscript superscript to the term symbol to the term symbol and it is denoted as examples written like this that is 2 s let 2 p 2 d etc. 2 the multiplicity term then that levels and the total or inner quantum number the total and inner quantum number to the total or the total or we can say it as the inner quantum number inner, inner quantum number j j value is added to a right subscript right subscript subscript how let we take a tabulation to write this the tabulations are prefer like this here are the terms in that column here are the L column and then let J as L plus S column then the full notation full notation preference for S term as S L will be 0 then spin is half so 0 plus half that is have full notation this is the term symbol as in the superscript multiplicity to s half ok that for s then for p l is 1 d s plus half and minus half that means 3 by 2 and half and the full notation 
that is 2p 3 by 2 then 2p half then for d it will be 2 then that is 5 by 2 plus half for s and min ma ma minus half means 2 minus half that is 3 by 2 written as 2 d 5 by 2 2 d 3 by 2 ok in some cases n is also added to that of term symbol example if uh, we written like this uh, 2 2 p half for that uh, symbol denotes here here the principal quantum number n stands for 2 2 and uh, l stands for since it will be p l stands for 1 and uh, s stands for spin quantum number is half and again j stands for j stands for half 0 l stands for 1 j j stands for 3 by 2 or half Okay, a, here this is the value of j, j stands for half. Okay, from that notation, we clarify all these terms. In some cases, uh, for the atom containing several electrons, this is the, the atom containing two electron. If uh, the atom consists of uh, several electrons, uh, how we follow the rule? The orbital angular momentum of each electron compile among the among themselves to give the resultant electron orbital angular momentum of that atom and the total electronic angular momentum will be the sum of spin angular momentum and orbital angular momentum that can be written. So, these are the basic rules by using these rules we noted it so with the help of this video lecture we understand what is spectroscopic terms and notations these are the rules according to the rules some examples are preferred what is multiplicity what is terms and the notation principle and what we designate the significance of that notations and again if we consider a atom consisting of uh, more than two electron system then the sum of uh, orbital angular momentum and uh, spin angular momentum is equal to that of total angular momentum that can be found out. So, with this useful and infinite notes, let me wind up this session. Thank you.